In this video, I'm going to show you how you can use the Murph AI voice changer. I'm going to show you step by step how that works so that you can start using it. I'll leave links to a free trial for Murph AI in the description, as well as a full platform tutorial so that you can learn how the other features work. For now, let's go to the voice changer. So as of right now, how this works is that you open up the Murph AI studio, which looks like this. This is where you can build out your voiceover. But before you do that, you do need to load in the script. Now with the voice changer feature, you don't lead the script up front. What you do is you click voice changer, select a file, and then you upload your file, which can be an MP3 or an MP4 file. Now what they'll then do, which is pretty cool, I'll upload this file right here, is select a language. For me, it's gonna be English, for you it might be different, is it's gonna extract the subtitles or the captions from the video that you upload so that you can change the voice. So if you do a voiceover with your voice and you take that file, you upload it in here, it's gonna extract the subtitles or captions. And then because of that, you can put those captions into a different voice, one available on Murph AI, and you've just changed your voice, even though you, you said it, which is pretty cool. So as of right now, it's still processing. Now, depending on how long your video is, it might take a while, it might take a few minutes, it might take a little bit longer, but it should be done pretty quickly. I'll get back to you guys once that is done. And there we go, this took about one minute, and then for me right now, the script is loaded in. I'm in transcription mode, what I can now do is accept and save all, make sure it's all right though, and there we go. You can see that they have now transcripted my entire video, which you can see right here, into the voiceover. Now still, they have got a lot of sentences, so what you can do, is split it up if you want to. You can do it like that if you want to, but that is how that works. Now what we can now do is select the voiceover character that we want to use to change our voice. Now I'm not gonna use Nate as he's not the greatest voice. I'll go to Rachel, which is funny because I'm a male and I'm gonna change my voice into a female voice. I said all of this stuff, but right now Rachel is gonna say it. So what I'll do is I'll simply select this and I'll start playing this for you guys right now so that you know it works. Now, if you're not sure how Murph AI works, you can need use the generate audio feature, which I'll teach you in the full platform guide as well, link down below, um, to generate it. And then once you click play, it's gonna play for you. I'll show you what that sounds like right now. Are you tired of seeing watermarks on your Picture AI videos? We have good news for you. All right, there you go. Now you can see it's very like quick. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna add a pause right here or a comma that should get the job done as well are you tired of seeing watermarks on your pig 3 ai videos we have good news for you that's better than blah, 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 blah. that's what it usually does are you tired of seeing watermarks on your picture ai videos we have good news for you all right that's much better now depending on your script and the things you say the voiceover might sound great right away and sometimes you have to play around with this but that is how you can use the voice changer feature the voice changer feature is all about loading in a video or an audio file extracting the subtitles and then changing it to one of the characters on murph ai now if you're curious about the best voiceovers on murph i'll leave a link to that video in the description down below as well as the best free voiceovers on murph all the resources you'll find in the description down below, including free trial links, platform guides, tutorial videos about other stuff on Murph. You'll find it. I've made it. So let me know how this works for you, and I'll see you in the next video.